And then you pour in a quarter cup of flour, two dashes of cinnamon, dash, dash, and shake it up. Now, the pen. Roll it. Dust it. Take the tape. Press down lightly. Pat, 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 and voila! The print! Rad. Homemade fingerprint kit. Capturing fingerprint. And it's great for jewels. We got a partial print. And a partial match. <laughs> go <laughs> us, go <laughs> us. Go you, go you. Now we can tell people that Mikhail's the bad guy. Girl. I don't know. If this girl's really involved in something as huge as threatening the prince's flight, I think we're gonna need more proof than a partial print. Then I guess we're gonna have to catch this Mikhail McAllister in the act of doing something worth catching. that fancy pen I gave her in class? Mm -hmm. Camera pen! <laughs> Sorry, Michaela. The quail wants to brief you on the mission status right now. The quail? That must be like a conan for the evil mastermind she's working for. I want one of those. I want one of those! Who the heck is this girl? Who wants to know? Spying on me? Please don't hurt us. We were just... Uh, just, um... Just, uh... Spying on me. Isn't that right, Adrian Adams? Or was it your idea, bride and bandwidth? Oh, sorry to interrupt. Oh, taste testers! Hurry up and drink this while it's still ever resting and in liquid form. Really think she could help us? Duh. Remember her exploding cream puffs from the science fair? She could whip up anything. I'm calling it Adri's pink drink. Safety first. Careful. I don't want curiosity to kill the can. Hmm. Tastes like chocolate chip cookie dough and a glass of milk. Pass. I just whiten my teeth. It's a secret recipe passed down from my grandma. She's known as the best culinary chemist in Spain. Culinary chemist? That's a thing? Yes, of course it is. Adri, do you want to help us with a top secret investigation? Secret investigation? You mean like, Mission Impossible? Uh, yeah, like Mission Impossible. Oh, I love those movies! When I was little, I used to watch them all the time. I even told my parents I wanted to work for the Centro Nacional de Inteligencia. It's like the CIA in Spain. 
Know anything about lifting fingerprints? Hmm. 1.5 million dollars. An exorbitant amount of money by any account for a vacation. But for Prince Xander of Canterbury, known throughout social media as the Trillionaire Prince, it's another extreme stunt that has him yet again in the international spotlight. It's totally awesome! As the impending launch looms, the Prince appears ever more carefree about the possible mortal danger. Now's our chance. Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't see your pretty little feet there. We haven't met. I'm Adrian Adams. Adrian, wanna do lunch sometime? I'm such a foodie. I know all the fanciest places to eat in this town. There's like two, but they're fabulous. again. Can't seem to hold on to my supplies around you. Weird, huh? Uh, that's my pen. Uh, you don't want this pen. It got sticky from the sticky ground. But I like sticky things. Sticky glue, sticky notes, sticky rice, sticky tape, sticky sticks. <laughs> uh, so here, take mine. Um, Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's A O S R N. <gasps> Ali is here at our school right now. <laughs> Come with us. Come. <laughs> it's them in the flesh, and they're playing. It worked right here at Maywood Glen Academy. I dreamt this day would come where I'd finally meet Eli and I'd say hi and he'd say hi and I'd say I love your music and he'd say cool and we'd start snapchatting and texting and we'd follow each other on Instagram and people would think we were besties but we'd say it's nothing <laughs> but it's actually something Paul there's something all right Kim and I have loved Elite's music for so long I've studied it actually I broke down all their drops and listened to all their tracks Eli's a musical genius my favorite is this is nothing what's yours Em? Actually, there's so many that I haven't heard. I don't know their music. If only I were you to listen to their music again for the very first time. What's up, Maywood Glen Academy? It's good to be home. I miss you guys. I also miss my Grandma Jay's oatmeal cookies. I love you, Grandma. Anyway, as all of you know, we just came back from a very successful world tour. And as a way to thank our hometown, we will be giving a free concert at this very school! Hey, Michaela. Oh, hey, Kyle. That's pretty cool of these guys to give a free concert, huh? Oh, yeah. You know, my brother and Eli were in a couple classes here together, and now Eli's a star, so kind of gives hope for average guys like me, huh? Not at all. What? No, I mean, you're not average, and you have a shot at being more than average. Oh, uh, yeah, thanks. Um, that's encouraging. Uh, well, I'm just gonna quit while I'm ahead here, but uh, see ya. <sighs> one step forward, two steps back. I think you mean two steps forward and one step back? I wish I did, but we will get there. And for our return home, we have amazing news, Maywood Glenn. To tell you all about it, I'd like to bring up the man of the hour. The man that made it all happen. Our sponsor, Simon Temple! No way, no way! I can't believe Simon Temple is here in Maywood Glen! Just breathe, just breathe. Okay, too much breathing. Simon Temple is epic, and he's not even 30. He just made the annual list of global entrepreneurs under 30. <laughs> He's worked with all the hot young innovators. Ricky Muller, Leah Busk, Lisa DeLuca. And one day I hope, me. Hey, uh, Devin, um, I don't have you down here for an audition. Because I'm not, I'm just 
doing a favor for Brie and Pam. I got these color filters for your light show. Trust me, you'll like it. Do we have a choice? Nope. Uh, it's Brian Cam. She does not care. Yeah, she still calls me Lyle. Yeah. Anyway, good luck. Yo, Camsterdam. Congrats on, if you're lucky, second place. <laughs> Well, you know what else is number two, Justin? Yeah, let's not go there. He's just trying to get in your head. Well, it's working. He's in there. This is my one shot to make an impression on Simon Temple. What if he doesn't like what I've created? Are you kidding? Simon's gonna flip when he sees how insanely talented you are. Plus, with my EDM beats, we're gonna crush it. Circuit beats, you're up. <sighs> let's do this. Go, girl! Yeah! Yeah! Lazarus is trash. If we dig through it, we could find some clues. Michaela, I never would have thought of you as the dig through garbage type. Bet. I just wish you had given me a chance to change out of my new heels. They're Mew Mew. At least they were. Look what I found. Who would want to throw these away? I me. would. They're not really my style. Haters. Hey, Cam. Can we use this for a water powered car? Kinda hoping that we jumped off that water-powered car cliff. No way. I will take Justin down at the tech fair. Nice find, Adri. Except it's a carburetor. They used to be a big part of internal combustion engines, but have been replaced in the car industry by fuel injectors. You have no idea what she's talking about, do you? No. I just want to go home and take a hot bubbly bath with it. Hey guys, check it out. It's an issue of Cat Fancy Magazine addressed to a Mr. Carson Lazarus. She must get that a lot. Lazarus has a cat. Let's find out. Is this this great? It's my cat camera device. Or as I like to call it, Cameron's cat camera to follow a cat around the house device. You know, I think I'm learning the drill. Killer with inventions, bad with names. Well, it works. I routed it through the Innovate server so we could all watch it through our tablets. <clears throat> and Addison. Why did you make a cat cam? I was curious what my sister's kitty Helix the cat did while I was at school all day. And there's Lazarus. Who's hungry? Oh, did I tell you guys? Mi abuela hired a new chef. 
It's awesome. Now I'll be able to dedicate more time to Cafe Adam's newest signature blended drink. The... Churachino! I was hoping for some applause. PD applause? Oh no! Michaela, you have your Froyo study session with Kyle! Uh, you know what? We're in the middle of a stakeout and the clock is ticking on Retro's demand, so I think I'm just gonna cancel. No, you're not. For the Quail's request, we're under strict orders to help you maintain your social cover as a normal teenager. Okay, but given the circumstances, I think the Quail would agree. But, 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 but. No cancellations. You can't flake. You need to blend in. Like my Churro Chino. Get it? Blend it? Still nothing? I have no idea what to say to Kyle. I'm good with smart talk, not small talk. You're going to do fine. And I'll be there to help you. You take Addison, and Brian and I will watch the cat cam on our tablet. And we'll let you know if anything exciting happens. Isn't this refreshing? Nobody sneaking glances down to their screens. Everybody ready to learn? Uh. Now, you will have to write down your answers to today's quiz on a piece of paper with a pencil. The yellow wooden thingy with the rubber doodad on the end? Yes, Justin. The yellow wooden thingy with the rubber doodad on the end. Kyle. Look, I'm really sorry about before. I just have some things on my mind. It's fine. No big deal. You ever hear the one about the geometry class that was always tired? They were out of shape. She could shape and geometry. <sighs> Commence bugging. Where's that coming from? Class, I think we have a visitor. Where are you? It's my portable long range acoustic device. I modified the extra ultrasound sensors for my dad's remote control model rocket. Over here? It's for Helix the cat's birthday. Gotcha. You made your sister's cat a birthday present? And if you spoil the surprise for him, I'll be awake right now. Uh, you know, I think it's coming from over there. Hmm? Uh, nope, it's definitely coming from over there. Everyone just focus on your work. Let's see what you're hiding in your man purse, Gruber. Uh, gotcha. With Tuna with the crust cut off. Happy teaching. Love, mom. Ah, my hand's creeping up. A screen. We're back on the grid. Greetings, Maywood Glenians. How you suffer without your precious technology. No texts, no phone calls, no games. Well, cry me a river.